Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have been in the spotlight for their entire relationship, but over the past few months, the scrutiny reached new heights. The royal couple couldn't seem to avoid the negative press, and no matter what they did, the press and public found fault. Whether or not the Duke and Duchess of Sussex actually deserved the negativity, and many maintain that they do deserve at least a bit of it, they have managed to remain in the dead center of bad press all summer long. Recently, royal sources opened up about all the negative publicity that Prince Harry, in particular, has received, and how he should take a page from his older brother's book to get back into the public's good graces. Prince Harry has been accused of being stuck up. Prince Harry has always been committed to various social justice causes and has shown a considerable passion for environmental issues. In recent years, Prince Harry has stepped up his game in terms of dedicating his time to charities that matter to him. In the summer of 2019, Prince Harry attended several different climate change events, speaking out about the importance of doing everything possible in order to preserve the Earth and reverse the effects of global warming. However, he received massive backlash due to the fact that he took several private jets, even as he lectured others about reducing their carbon footprint. Many media outlets and royal watchers called Prince Harry a fake activist after the multiple private flights. But instead of owning up to his mistakes, Prince Harry acknowledged the backlash by stating that he does fly private in order to protect his family. While Prince Harry did admit that everyone can do better, the reaction to his interview was overwhelmingly negative, with many viewing him as stuck up and wrongly taking the moral high ground. Sources say that Prince Harry should slow down. The negative publicity that Prince Harry has received hasn't gone unnoticed by anyone. Most notably, those who monitor the royal family. Recently, a royal expert opened about how Prince Harry could possibly work to reverse the bad press. The expert recommended that rather than rambling on and on in LA speak, Prince Harry should practice getting to the point more. She also suggested that Prince Harry should be humble and stop taking the moral high ground which acts as a distancing mechanism and only causes people to frown on whatever he's saying, even if he's speaking with good intentions. Prince William and Prince Harry are very different people. As the royal expert states, Prince William has a much more reserved, dignified bearing, which has served him well in public life. Granted, Prince William is set to be the next king, and will always occupy a different place within the royal family than Prince Harry who has much less responsibility and much more freedom in the way he conducts himself. Still, the Duke of Sussex would do well to pattern some of his behavior after Prince William's, at least in the terms of his measured, calm demeanor. Prince Harry has earned the reputation of being rather reactionary, so it certainly couldn't hurt him to follow the Duke of Cambridge's example. All of that being said, Prince Harry and Prince William are very different and have different relationships with the public. For years, Prince Harry was one of the most beloved members of the royal family. Sadly, Prince Harry is in danger of losing his favored status with the public unless he manages to turn the narrative around within the next few months.